right? Black Science TV 111. Oh, sake of four. I'm back at y'all again. <laughs> I don't even know if I should even address this issue, but I will. Now, I don't get where a lot of these lunatics in the so-called conscious community are referring to their own people as being pseudoscientists. Who, who came up with that terminology? And why are we even using pseudoscience, which is a European terminology, as a weapon against our own people, knowing that Europeans don't have a fucking science? Make up your mind, niggas. You say that we taught the white man, but yet when we start using scientific notations and formulas that's out of our own spiritual book, we pseudoscience. We are only using the root to stuff that they plagiarized science by. So therefore, when you call when you call it your own brother pseudo pseudoscience, you have to understand and understand that you are using a white. You are mad because we are not using the terminology of a European, and you can't get mad because we don't want to go by Europeans' definitions or we want to define science as being what um, Europeans define science by. You can't get mad at that. Because when you say pseudoscience, that means that we are not adhering to somebody else's formula. Now, why would you get mad at us or other brothers like me for even utilizing something that we are spirit? Now, let's go back to let's go back to um, our ancestors for a minute. Did our did our ancestors use books? Did the Dogons use books to um, identify Series A and Series B? Did they did they did they utilize microscopes? No, they didn't. But were they pseudoscientists? No, they wasn't. They didn't use European um, tactics when it came to science. They used their own jurisdiction of words and languages and tactics when it came to being, to, when it came to being able to define their own science. So therefore, we have to get out of that rhetoric. Just because you don't understand or understand anything that the universe is putting through certain brothers today don't mean that they're pseudoscientists. Pseudoscience was, is a formula created by Europeans, so you're using their weapons against your own people because you don't understand or understand the shit that the universe is giving to these new brothers today. So therefore, I will be a pseudoscientist. Why? Because I do not adhere to nobody else's formula. I only adhere to my formula and my formula only. So guess what? I'm going to make being a pseudoscientist the style now. So guess what? Osaka 4 is a pseudoscientist. I don't, I, don't, I don't get niggas. <clears throat> I don't get niggas. But if I was around here busting a nigga's head open or shooting a brother down, that would be cool. I guess that's our science, to kill each other. They made that our science. That's what's common to us today. But as soon as a brother gets into spirituality and starts to contact other mediums outside of itself to bring back into the dimension, to, to try to give it to you so you don't have to use even the word pseudoscience or try to use the plagiarized or genetically modified sciences that they're putting on the table, I guess that right there is wrong. <clears throat> but it's okay. Because pseudoscience is good. Because, again, what is, the, what is the definition? One who do not adhere to, right, the science of somebody else's formula. And I do not adhere to nobody's formula because we know that Europeans have no science. They are still studying. They are still studying things as small as the moon. They don't even know what the moon consists of. They don't, even, they don't even know the elements of the moon, nor do they know the benefits of the moon. They don't even know the elements of the sun. This is, this is elementary. But guess what? For me saying that, I'm pseudoscience. It's okay. It's fine. Because at the end of the day, being a pseudoscientist helps you to think for yourself. That means that you're thinking on your own formula and notations, not nobody else's. So with that much said, Black Science TV 111, Osaka 4, I'm out. Peace.